Goedemorgen, class. What language was that? That was Dutch. And if you forgot, that's okay. We'll say it again one of these days. Um, just, just giving you this video to check up on you and see how you're doing. This has been a crazy day today, hasn't it? We wake up and there's an earthquake. And I, I don't know. I don't know what's next. But I hope what's next is we get to be together again very soon. So until then, I'll just keep sending you little videos and reading you stories and telling you how I'm doing. And then you can send me pictures and maybe little videos of how you're doing. I hope all is well and you are listening to what your parents are telling you and you're doing some of the homework that I sent them for you to do. I don't want you to get too far behind. Um, just keep reading, get on Imagine Learning and do that. We still have to do 45 minutes a week even though you're home. So get on that and do 45 minutes if you can. And listen to mom and dad. They're probably a little stressed out trying to do school and work and everything. So listen to mom and dad and help them out. Um, today is Derek's birthday. Happy birthday, Derek. What a birthday for you, earthquake and all. So when we get back together, we are going to have to have a big, huge birthday celebration with all the birthdays in our class and it will be wonderful. So today I'm doing this from my home because I was not allowed in the school today because of the earthquake. So um, anyway, just doing my office so the lighting's a little different and the book will be different. So I'll have to hold the book different when I show you the pages. But just know I miss you and that you are cared for and just keep sending me pictures and talking to me and tell me, telling me how you are doing. If you need passwords for your uh, clever, um, website, just have your parents give me a text or an email and I'll give that to them. So the book I have chosen is, and it's backwards, Waiting is Not Easy. I thought this would be a good one because all of us are waiting. We're waiting to get back to school. It's not easy. It's not easy for me, it's not easy for you, it's not easy for mom and dad, but it'll be okay. We can handle this. But this is our favorite author, Mo Willems, and this is our story today. Gerald! I have a surprise for you. Yay, what is it? The surprise is a surprise. Oh? Is it big? Yes. Is it pretty? Yes. Can we share it? Yes! And look how excited Elephant is. Look at that. That's how excited we'll be when we get to be back together. Look at that face. Isn't that cute? I cannot wait! Uh, you'll have to. Look how sad he is now. He has to wait. Wait? What? Why? The surprise is not here yet. Hmm. So I will have to wait for it? Yes. Groan. He lets out a pretty big groan because he is a pretty big elephant. It almost overtook Piggy there. Oh well, if I have to wait, I will wait. He's not very excited about it, but 
he will wait. I am waiting. Just stand there. He's just waiting. Hmm. Waiting is not easy. Piggy, I want to see your surprise now. I am sorry, Gerald, but we must wait. Groan! That groan's even bigger than the last one. This time, Piggy's on the ground. I am done waiting. I do not think your surprise is worth all this waiting. I will not wait anymore. Okay, I will wait some more. It will be worth it. Groan! Well, now Piggy, uh, he's underneath the groan. Look, he's like clear under that groan. It's quite big. Piggy! So, he's a little worried because when he groaned, uh, he knocked Piggy out. We have waited too long. It is getting dark. It is getting darker. Soon we will not be able to see each other. Soon we will not be able to see anything. We have wasted the whole day. Well, um, we have waited and waited and waited and waited. That's how this is going to feel like doing school online. You're going to feel this way, but it's okay. The end will be worth it, right? And for what? For that. Now, was that worth waiting for? All the stars in the sky. He had to wait for nighttime for those stars to appear. Now, sometimes in life, things happen, and we have to wait, and we have to wait, and we have to wait. And we don't know when the end will be, but it's okay. When it's over, we'll get back together and, and the end is worth it. So be like Piggy, an elephant, and be patient and wait. And this one right here says, tomorrow morning I want to show you the sunrise. It says, I cannot wait. So... One of these days, we'll be together again, but it's okay. For right now, we're learning just a little bit of a different way. And we get, still get to see each other and be together this way. So, um, we'll talk to you another day, probably tomorrow. Goodbye, class.